Hey, what's up, you guys? This is BenJXTX, and I'm back to share another video with you guys. This video is actually this in uh, 816. Now, for this module, what we're going to do since it's the end of the year is we're going to take the top weapons that we've learned in Chairbound as Kremlin and devote a week to each weapon. Now, to begin, we have the Nunchaku. This is one of the most request weapons. I always um, get emails about demonstrating or messages about demonstrating. So, what we're going to do today is take the Legendary Nunchuck and teach you how to do a simple shoulder pass. Now, everybody knows how to do the, do the quick shoulder passes. These shots are a little bit heavier because for me, they concentrate. I concentrate on strength training as well as coordination when I'm doing the nunchuck. So I'm not gonna whip these chucks around like you normally would. What I'm going to do is show you how to do a simple shoulder pass. Now you're holding the chuck like so and you flip one end behind you. And you grasp it with the other hand. Almost as if you're using a whip. But you flip it behind you and pull it through. And as you pull it through, the bottom chuck that you want, the bottom chuck becomes the top chuck. On the opposite side. Pull it through, the top shot will then become the bottom shot. And it's okay if you hit something when you're doing this. Just make sure that it's not valuable, it's not glass, or anything like that, because it will break. Unless you're using the rubber chucks or uh, foam chucks that I recommend for beginners because there's a possibility you may hit yourself and with the rubber or foam chucks it won't hurt if you're using regular wood chucks ah yeah it's gonna sting a bit wood or metal chucks it's gonna sting a bit so unless you're a professional or been trained Properly, go with the go with the foam chucks or the rubber chucks. But let, let's start again. Now, you're grasping one end of the chuck. You flip the other one. You flip the other end behind you, and you catch it with your other hand. Pull it through. The bottom chuck will then become the top chuck. Pull it through. The bottom chuck will then become the top chuck on the other side. Now, how this works competitively is someone comes in with a hook punch, block it. Someone comes in with a punch overhead, block it. They may come in with the stick, you block it. Wrap it. 
with it as you're whipping it. Pull through, hit with the pull through, hit the chin with the bottom choke. And you whip with the top two. I hope that made sense with you guys for you guys. If it didn't, let me know, and I'll be happy to devote more time on this um, within the coming new year. Thank you guys for watching. Now, Wednesday's lesson will be, or excuse me, Monday's lesson. It's been a long morning. We had a freak snowstorm, so forgive me. And I don't know how long Howard's going to hold up, so I don't know when this will be posted. Um... But as I was about to say, Monday's lesson will focus on the small fixed blade. So be on the lookout for that in the lesson 817. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, comment, or request, please send them to my YouTube account. Or if you know how to get in touch with me on my personal Facebook, please do so there. Um, God bless. Thank you guys for watching. Be safe out there. And I will talk to you guys Monday. Bye-bye bye for now.